Hi guys! Today we're in a town on the south coast of England that has been a holiday hotspot for decades. And this idyllic seaside gem has an award-winning beach which is over 11 kilometers long. Wow! Let's check it out! Yes! So here we are, this is the Bournemouth beach, the long 11 kilometer beach. It's I huge. Know. It feels like it's never ending. You know what I really want to do? What? We have to feel the water. Okay, yeah, let's definitely let's feel the water. Let's see if it's warm or what do you think? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, it's, it's cold. I guess it would get warmer in summertime, the water is warm. I'm sure it does. Right now it's pretty chilly. Yeah. But we have seen some people swimming, I didn't know. we? They're Lots of shells too. Ooh, look at these. Oh, they're pretty. Oh, this one's nice. This one is pearly. Look at this one. That's like a proper shell. Did you find any nice ones? Ooh, that's beautiful. It's sparkly. It feels like one of those, you know, pearl earrings that people have. Oh, yeah. Maybe if I find the second you one. You could make that into an earring. Oh, look, this one's kind of similar to the one that you oh, had, Maria. Perfect. I got a pair of earrings. Thank yeah. you, Angelina. Look. Oh, that looks cute. I like wow. that. Right? Yeah. So guys, in a lot of coastal towns in England, they have piers. And this one is called Bournemouth Pier. And then they have the Boscombe Pier, which is over there. Yeah, it was opened in 1889 and it's 230 meters long. But the Bournemouth Pier is even longer. It's over 300 meters long. And at the far end, they have an adventure center where you can take a zip line from the pier all the way over to the mainland, among other things. That sounds so much fun, mm -hmm. but during this time of the year, it's only open on the weekends. Oh yeah. Otherwise, I would have loved to do that. Yeah, sounds fun. Oh wow, look at that. Guys, there's an arcade. Ooh, these games I love. My favorite thing to win would probably be the big bear that has like a sweater that says Bournemouth. Okay, here we go. There we go. Okay, we got it, we got him, we got him. We don't have him, we don't have him. Oh, no! no. <laughs> the disappointment. Well, I'm gonna do it. Okay, you do it. I believe in you. Come on. <gasps> okay, you, okay, you, okay. You almost had that. I can spend like two hours trying to get the story out. Yeah, we should leave before you do that. Yes, we Let's should. go. We should leave. <laughs> This is the Bournemouth Cliff Lift. The shortest funicular rise in the world. <laughs> We're here at the colorful beach hut. They're so pretty. They are. Do you want the picture? Yeah, of course. Okay, I want to do something like that. Angelina, the hot owner. I feel like I'm a pro surfer. That's a good one. You look good. Now I want one too. Thank you. <laughs> okay, that was perfect. There you go. That's nice. Good post. <laughs> that was so much fun, wasn't it? Oh, I know, they're so cute. They are. And in the summertime, you can rent these for the day if you want. Yes, and they have a couple of chairs and an umbrella. How nice. Yeah, lovely. Oh, look, they have fish and chips. Yeah, let's definitely get some. We are in Bournemouth. Mm, we got the goodies. It's like the most classical British dish that you can think of. It is. It's a whole fish, guys. It is. I'm it's pretty impressed. big. Mm, hot, mm. hot, hot. Very good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I heard that another classical way to eat it is that somebody adds okay. smashed peas. Mm. I think it's called mushy peas. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it's always the same kind of fish. The most common ones are cod and haddock. Mm -hmm. I always like this whole idea that you can just grab a food and then come and eat by the beach. I think eating in beautiful surroundings helps the appetite. It does, especially when the weather is so nice like it is today. Oh, this was nice. It was. Well, yeah. let's go see some more of Bournemouth. Yes. Let's come, come. Oh, this area is really nice. I know. I think it's called Pier Approach. Mm -hmm. And you have a lot of different things to do here. It's all these little different restaurants and cafes. And over there, I think they have another arcade where you can play some games if you want. This is great. Lots of things to enjoy here, guys. Yeah, I really like the vibe here. It's like very relaxed and really laid back. This looks like some kind of a flight simulator, which yeah. can be kind of fun. Royal Air Force Association's HD experience. Yeah. Look at that, a bouncing castle. A big oh. bouncy castle with the minions on it, which is cute. I wish they would let me in those things. I know it's only for kids, but I think they're so much fun. I know. So there's a, even a little train that you there can ride. There is a train that you can Look, ride. Guys. Super cute. If you're here visiting and you want to get a good view of like the whole beach area, then you could take the little train. 
all these people sitting down and relaxing, oh, I also want to do that. Me too. Do you want to get an ice cream? Ice cream sounds really good. Yes, and I saw a good place. Did you? Okay, yes, let's come. go there. Oh, guys, Ooh. this is really yummy ice cream. So good. Mm. What flavor did you go for? Salted caramel. You? This is white chocolate with honeycomb crunch. This and it is, is delicious. delicious. <laughs> I really like this area of Bournemouth. Don't you? Me too. Sometimes I enjoy just sitting down and people watching. You yeah. make stories, like sometimes you All see a person. The time. And then I'm like, them and them are going here and there because... Yeah, I'm like, just imagining, I wonder how this person is living their life, where are they off to, what have they been doing. Fine. It is fun. It's, fun. it's like story making. He's on a strike, a doggy strike. He won't move. <laughs> <laughs> I love this Ferris wheel and it's white and that fits perfectly into this beach surroundings. I know, it's actually really pretty here. You know what? I feel like we should take a ride on the Ferris wheel. Really? You want to? Of course I want to. You're not scared of heights, are you? No, I'm not. I love okay. heights. Okay, let's get some tickets. Let's go. We're about to get a great view of Bournemouth, so get ready. There's a beautiful park right there with a big church tower. I know. It's a very long beach. It's one of the longest beaches I think I've ever seen. It is never ending. It's like all the way there. Yeah. I can't see the end on either side. This has been nice. We made it down. Guys, this has been nice. Yeah, it's been wonderful. I really liked seeing the view from all the way up there. We recognized some of the places that we've seen on the beach, so that was super fun. Yes. Guys, we had such a lovely day by the beach today. Yeah, we did. The weather is great. We got to try some British fish and chips, which was awesome. Yes, and we have a very British prize for you. We do. We have a molten brown soap that you can win if you answer the question, what is your favorite thing to do at the beach? Do you prefer to lay down and tan or are you more of an activity kind of person? Please comment below. The best answer is going to get the soap. And make sure to come and watch the next episode because we're gonna go and look at some goodies and try some goodies. Thank you for watching. Bye. See ya.